Hello guys, welcome to our tutorial of PostgreSQL. In this tutorial, we learn how to alter our tables in uh, PostgreSQL. So to begin that, uh, I'll be using the table that we created, that is the company table. So first of all, I'll tell you how to add a column uh, in our uh, existing database. So you could do it by uh, the SQL syntax. I will show you. You will just uh, add uh, alter table company add this is the column name that you're gonna add that is gender and now you will enter the data type that is character of size one so you could see this uh, this is returned successfully and if you see select star from a company you would see that this column has been added in my table you see this this is not defined right now because I have not put any values so you could put in any values uh, in this so yeah so the next thing that we're going to do is we are going to drop this column we could do it by uh, alter table company drop column gender so we'll run this and you see it returns successfully again and if you check it select star from company you would see that this column has been gone so this is the way you add and delete columns by SQL query in PostgreSQL next uh, next thing that I'm going to show you is how to add a primary key by SQL query if you have not added it in your uh, in your uh, development period or the time when you created your table you have not added a primary key so you could add your primary key at a later stage by this query by altering your table that is alter table company add constraint that is the name of the key that you're going to give suppose i'll give it primary or uh, not primary uh, pry and uh, you would write uh, primary key and you will write the ID that is primary key that is my ID would be my primary key so you would execute this and it runs successfully so you could just check it uh, in your properties of the table that this has been added as the primary key I will show you uh, you put up on, uh, open your PG admin and just click on properties and just click on constraints and you would see that I have a constraint name pry that is the primary key now so next I'm going to show you how to remove a primary key by programming that is uh, alter table company drop constraint pry that was the primary key that I defined the name of the constraint once pry so you could just remove it by its constraint name and you would see it has removed so now if you would check the properties you would see that you need to refresh it and you would see that it is gone now and you could see that it is not there so this was all for the alter table now the simplest way you could add or delete any columns in your table that is uh, you could do it by a new column here and you could just write the name that is gender right uh, gender and data type you could uh, create as care character and you would see that it has been created and the simplest way to delete is the right click on it and just delete it and the simplest way to add a primary key is to click on properties go to constraints and in the primary key you can click on add and you would write pry and uh, for the columns just add ID and click add that's okay and okay so you would see that the primary key has been added so this is the simplest way or the graphical way you could do it so thank you for watching this tutorial subscribe for more and stay tuned